Hey, based on the huge number of questions on NVIDIA's Shadowplay audio volume issues, I thought it would be a good idea to pass on some of my fixes. Actually, they're not fixes. They're just a way to boost the audio volume by 20 to 30 percent. Now, how, and I, how I and a bunch of other users suddenly ran into this issue were mostly Fraps users who were waiting until the last minute to switch over to Windows 10 without realizing that Fraps and Windows 10 were not compatible. I had NVIDIA Shadow Play on my system via the GTX 750 graphics, so I thought I had a safe fallback, which was a logical move. NVIDIA is a good operation with great products, excellent customer commitment, and they threw in a free screen capture via Shadow Play. Works great, except the audio piece, which needs a boost to make it more usable. So here we are, after a bit of research, idea sharing, trial and error period. Here's what I came up with as a workaround until the video has a chance to come up with something. Okay, one more time. This is not a fix to the Shadow Play audio feature. All this is is a quick and simple way to boost up the volume by 20 to 30 percent, which usually goes a long way to help work around the low volume issue. So, let's do this thing. Quick, easy, and step by step. Okay, the first thing we've got to do is get the control panel screen up. Okay, that is if you can find out where Windows 10 hid the damn thing. Okay, next thing we do is go to the sound card. That's here. Now, if you're having problems finding out where the control panel is, just go down here and click on the volume icon and hit recording devices and that'll get you to the same screen. Yeah, there's a half dozen ways you can do this thing but this is the the card that we start with. Okay, on the sound page uh, what we're going to do is uh, go to recording click on that, go down to microphone and highlight it, go down to properties there you go and then go to levels okay what I'm gonna do is up the level here I've got it at 48 we're gonna push that over all the way to the max 100 okay hit OK just to lock it in okay we're back on the microphone page do one more thing uh, we go to properties again go on up to the toolbar and hit advanced okay everybody ignores this next one but you see some notable increases in audio quality which does include some volume Okay, down here the default uh, thing lists one channel 16-bit 44K CD. Now scroll it on down, and what we're going to do is up that to DVD quality. Okay, now hit the OK button, and we're done with this piece. And the last thing we'll change is the NVIDIA settings in the volume mixer. Important to note here, uh, this last thing will only show up when the shadow play is engaged or recording. Now go back on down to the lower left and click on the volume control icon again. Next pull up the volume, open the volume mixer. Okay, and on the NVIDIA capture server here, you can increase the volume, but don't max it out because you'll end up with some sound distortion. This works great if you are just doing a voiceover, but if you also have a music track locked in, you'll find that the music will drown out anything you say. For some reason, the speakers and the NVIDIA capture control levels are connected. So, let's up the volume here, but once you get to this line, it's going to start dragging the speakers. So anyway, leave it in the middle, and let's keep going. And that's it. It took much, much longer to explain this process rather than just doing it. So to close, uh, here's a quick sample of a plain vanilla voiceover with no mods or nothing jacked up versus one with the three changes we just added. Uh, first test, uh, no mods to the volume, just stock stuff. Uh, to quote some Shakespeare, uh, two households, both alike in dignity and fair Verona, where we lay our scene from ancient grudge breakout. And now the comparison test with all three mods online. Let's do Shakespeare again. Two households, both alike in dignity and fair Verona, where we lay our scene from ancient grudge break to new mutiny, blah, blah, blah. Shakespeare, give me a break. Dude, stay away from the stage performing. So there it is. Some noticeable improvement in volume and sound quality. 
Oh, great timing here. I just heard that NVIDIA just came out for the new release, so hopefully they have the volume fix in. If not, you can always use the mod you just got here as a fallback. If you enjoyed this thing or if you found it of value, please leave us a like. That really, really helps out a lot. And if you want to be first in line for the new stuff that we have coming out, just mash that subscribe button. See ya and peace out.